made it to day three. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> so I hope that the past two days have been just, just enough good information that you can just start thinking about what your body is actually telling you, right? We talked day one about listening to our cravings, what those are, that they're real, that they exist, and what we need to do. We started on day two talking about what we need to do to actually address those issues. So if you're struggling with carbs and sugar, we talked about those insulin levels, how they get out of whack, and today we're going to talk about how we can actually um, help our body as we're decreasing those carbs and sugar levels and, and how to deal with the rest of the cravings we've been experiencing, right? All right, so um, we definitely want to increase our good fats in our dinner meal. What do I mean by that? I mean, if you increase your good fat during that supper time meal, what's going to start to happen is you're going to be less hungry in the morning. Okay. So we want our plate to be full of uh, vegetables, green leafy vegetables. Um, we want to have that fat component there. We want a great protein source and, you know, we want it to be organic if possible, grass fed if possible, you know, progress over perfection. But um, something that I like to do is I like to saute some kale with, uh, with the chicken breast and, you know, use um, a hollandaise sauce on top of it uh, to give me that really good fat, right? That's a great recipe. Um, you're welcome to reach out to me. I'll shoot that your way if you're interested. But what we want to do is we want to clean up our diet. Ooh, I know that sounds crazy. But um, when I say diet, I don't mean a diet you go on. I mean the food that you're eating. Because here's the truth. What your cravings are telling you is that your body is craving real food, right? And the problem is, is that we've been so addicted to the things that don't serve our body that once we start eating the right foods, our body is kind of like, whoa, what's up? What's going on, right? And we actually have a 48 hour window, okay? Where you will have the opportunity to reset your taste buds. So what I mean by this is, um, you, if you are you know, one of those people that's constantly drinking Coke or Diet Coke, Okay, artificial sweeteners are not good for your body. They don't serve you. Um, you can reach out to me. I'll shoot you some sweeteners that I use. Um, at the top of the list is stevia, um, monk fruit. Those types of things aren't going to give your blood sugar, uh, your insulin levels. They're not going to spike those things, but they're also, they taste really great. And there are a lot of tricks that you can use to make them taste even better. Um, anyway, so... Uh, we are going to start increasing our good fats at our supper time meal, okay? And then we are going to start increasing our electrolytes, okay? And I actually have a um, DIY electrolyte recipe that I'm gonna send your way. Uh, you can be on the lookout for it tonight or tomorrow. Um, and it's basically just a few of the things that I use that I find really cost-effective that help me reset um, my body as I'm, you know, like getting off of these cravings, what's going to happen is your body is still craving the magnesium, the sodium, the potassium, and those where you find those sources, how you find those sources are really important. So be on the lookout for that. And so what we're going to be doing is we're going to eat a dinner that's full of good fats and veggies. Okay. If you're a green bean lover, great. If you are whatever your, whatever your thing is that you love, start to eat that that's healthy. Okay. And we will, uh, as we will go and increase those good fats, that's going to help us long-term, uh, stop craving the things that don't serve us. And then I'm going to send you that DIY electrolyte recipe. I can't wait for you to try it. It's been such a big game changer for me as I have been just getting healthy. So, uh, be on the lookout for that. And day four is fixing to head your way in just a few minutes.